we are now on the road to 200 subscribers so be sure to subscribe and leave a like because i make nba content just like this every single day so there there's your reason right there this video is not sponsored by nba 2k i thought it'd be funny i start off my video like that since i get the cuss scene um sounds like the voice acting from chris moves videos every video he says this video is sponsored by 2k I thought that was funny but here you see me upgrade my character this is the second episode welcome if you're new here subscribe and be a content every day but i upgraded my character i he is an 85 now i did max him out but for some reason you couldn't buy vc when the game first came out the first couple minutes what for like half an hour hour so i just stuck with you know my 100k vc went to 79 overall we're going to riverside meeting up with Kawhi leonard let's see what happens he doesn't talk much so we'll see if this video can hit three likes and i'll see you guys in a I bit a smile, hey what hey what you doing here man i thought you had a six or tonight i've been away for a while i'm in the band of town no smart talk, huh? Right. Hey, I appreciate the run, man. That was a good one. All right. <laughs> no, would you say it? I can call you anytime. Really? All right, cool, cool. Yeah. Well, you can tell me your secrets. You want to confide in me? That's fine too. What? Yeah, I'm down. Friday night. Let's do it. That's funny how Kawhi just doesn't talk. I find that effing hilarious. Che? Mm. Zach Bailey, man. Good to meet you. Big fan. All oh, right, sorry, man. I just, I what? <laughs> Expecting someone who shaves? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I know. Well, my mom says that I'll appreciate the baby face later, but right now I'm still single and getting carted at movie theaters, so I'm working on that James Harden thing, you know. So, uh, pre-draft. Anxious? Yeah, but you know what? It's time. Fair enough. Damn right. Well, I'm just gonna be level with you. Uh. The NBA execs are a little anxious about your decision to stay in school, and you couple that with your demonstration, and let's just say taking a flyer on an unproven 18-year-old starts to look a little bit more appealing. What happens to drafting someone who's, you know, mature, who can actually come in and contribute? Yeah, fair enough, but look, in this racket, potential will always reign supreme. But don't worry about it. We still got a chance, okay? I'm just trying to let you in on the perception that's out there. But I, uh, <clears throat> I do want to pick your ear about your little situation with the, your advisor. Who, Issa? Yeah. Oh, she just helped me out. I trust Issa. Okay. Well, did she have anything to do with your decision to stay in school or sit out that game? What are you getting at? <laughs> All I'm saying is, if you and I want to try and make it into the league, I can't have anyone else in your ear. Okay, so what do I tell her? Well, Che, you're a professional now. You say thank you and goodbye. I gotta go. I'm double parked in a handicap. Decent, but numbers are overrated anyway. I mean, KD couldn't bench 185 once. You think he's losing sleep over it? Actually, he may be, but he's a different type of cat, uh, you know. Look, Che, if you want this combine nod, you're gonna have to perform in these scrimmages. Stay within yourself, but be vocal. We're selling you as a locker room guy, yeah? Yeah, cool. Hey, what did the left eye say to the right eye? What? Between you and me, something smells. <laughs> huh? Isn't that stupid? Yeah, it is. It's pretty bad, yeah. I know, I didn't. I just, look. Tim Duncan used to have his strength coach tell him a joke before every game, you know, keep him loose. Just relax, Jay, and leave it all out there on the wood. Gotcha. All right, we are going to the Portsmouth Invitational. Scotty Pippen is going to be showing up real soon. It's another day on the wood, boss. How you got to look at it? Yeah, well, maybe for you. How many scouts you think made out to Montana to check on me, huh? 
Don't listen to him, Jonas. Che ain't got no worries. This don't pan out. Adam Silver will probably mention him himself. Poster boy for principal. <laughs> That's funny, Onyx. Well, I'd rather be the boy getting posted if it means I'm making a squad, you feel me? What's up, fellas? Hey, Whoa, what's up? Scotty Scotty what's up, man? Yeah, a lot of history in this locker room, man. Yeah, check this out. Take a look at this. You know, I'm from Arkansas. Youngest of 12. My dad worked in a mill. Nothing special about the way we grew up. Just poor folks. Sure some of you guys can relate to that, right? Yeah. You know, coming out of high school, I was only 6'1". 150 pounds, wet. I only received one offer, Central Arkansas, and that was to be the team manager. <laughs> but something happened between my freshman and my junior year. I caught inches. Yeah, I was 6'7 and starting to feast on cats. But this ain't no dude. This Central Arkansas. My coach is going crazy, going broke, calling all over, trying to get scouts just to come check me. But my senior year, a man named Marty Blake. Marty was known as the super scout for the NBA. He's helped out a lot of people like myself, John Stockton, Ben Wallace. He got us each into the Portsmouth invite, which changed our lives. If you want it bad enough, if you're willing to sacrifice, it will find you. I got six of those to prove it. And that's going to do it for me. I'm not going to show you the gameplay because there's really no need. I don't find it entertaining. I don't think you will. But we do have a couple of teams interested in us. So we're now a mid-second rounder. By the way, these are post-commentaries. I've already made it through the prelude by the time I'm recording this. But leave a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. New video might be coming out tonight. Might be coming out tomorrow. I don't know. We're, I'm just trying to grind out this series as much as possible. Leave a like if you guys enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. Shorter episode right now, but GG.